good evening you welcome back to my youtube channel my name is glory elijah and tonight guys it was really really an emotional live eviction show on the big brother niger show i wasn't really surprised with the result but the upcoming events for this week is what is actually putting my head in a shockwave right now all right guys so before i continue with this gist if you're new to my channel and you're just seeing this face for the first time kindly click on the red subscribe button pause the video first and click on the red subscribe button to become a part of this family and also guys turn on post notification it is the white bell button that's right beside the subscribe button it gives you a lot of all my videos i upload twice daily mornings before 10 a.m evenings before 10 p.m so guys without much further ado kathy has been evicted kathy is out of the game and she was totally totally shocked at the people that nominated her but most importantly she was more shocked by ek because of course we already know that in the house ek is like a younger brother to her ek is a friend they're almost like best friends just as she is close to tasha she's also very very much close to ek they talk a lot um she advises ek a lot so she was very very shocked because according to her last sunday that she was saved from eviction Ike was the first person that ran up to her and touched her and they were talking and having conversations and Ike is always making her feel very, very comfortable. So she was very, very shocked. And then she made a statement that that's probably why Ike never gets coins from evicted housemates because they have seen that he's like a two-faced person, you know? He's right there in front of you laughing and giving you assurances of him being loyal to you. And then in the diary room, he's all up behind your back evicting you or nominating you for possible eviction so it really really shook her and she also said that she feels like tasha is going to win that was when ibuka asked her who she felt was going to win the show so guys tasha um Shay and mike are safe for this week and also guys something interesting and mind-blowing is going to be happening on the show tonight by 10 p.m it's going to be a twist in the veto power game of chance yes so guys if you have access to your televisions don't forget to tune in to dstv channel 198 to watch it or if you cannot watch it i will see if i can post a new video about that if not tonight but first thing tomorrow morning now according to abuka the veto power game of chance is going to be having a very very crazy twist and it is going to take days for a winner to emerge you know formerly um by 10 p.m the housemates go into the arena and then they just select you know they just do playful things like just select a card and if you're lucky you get it if you're not lucky you do not get it so tonight's video power game of chance challenge is going to be very very different and um according to abuka the game is not going to end tonight it's going to start tonight and it's going to take days before a winner is going to emerge and finally when a winner emerges that winner is going to be the ultimate veto power holder what that means i am presuming is that that person will never be put up for eviction that person will never be nominated and that person will always always have the opportunity to be um nominating people for eviction and that brings me to the point of saying that according to abuka there will be no eviction this new week meaning that there will be no voting this new week and meaning also possibly that there will be no live nomination this week so guys the game is getting hotter and stiffer and <laughs> oh my god we do not even know what's going to happen and moving on guys to what had happened earlier um the game is getting really really stiff cindy was very very sad that Kathy left yeah because earlier today in um during a diary session she made it known to biggie that she doesn't want Kathy to leave because she's the only person that she definitely relates with that actually has an open mind towards her and for any other person she doesn't care who leaves and um also something very dramatic happened when abuka called tasha's name and told tasha that she had been you know saved you know so tasha apparently i it seems like she has been hearing all the gossips going on around in the house about her it seems like she knows those people who do not want okay she knows that basically all the housemates see her as a threat she knows so when Ebuka called her name and told her that she had been saved my god it was so funny um 
she was now saying no leave no transfer if you are tired of seeing in my face my face in this house just give yourself voluntary um, eviction or voluntary exit the door is that way you can leave and of course obviously mercy was not happy we know that mercy has been the one that has been waiting for either kathy or tasha to leave the house so um tasha started singing there is fire on the mountain roar, roar, roar. he was so funny she was disappointed sort of she was disappointed sort of and um yeah sorry guys the voting polls just came in so i'm trying to see as usual tacha is the highest followed by mike followed by shay and then kathy tacha has 28.51 i'm gonna post the voting polls result in my community tab mike has 26.44 percent shay 25.82 kathy 19.23 meaning kathy actually had a lot of votes but then um her vote still did not amount to the top three so don't worry guys i'm gonna post that result in my community tab as well for you to see so guys um the battle line has been drawn between mercy and tacha especially and she of course yeah because she is not happy that tacha is still in the house so guys watch out for these three people tacha and mercy and um, um Shay, yeah. I know that the other housemates, especially Elozonam, Elozonam, that one, he doesn't want to see Tacha at all. And today in the diary session, he mentioned to Biggie that he doesn't want to see Tasha and Kathy in the house, even at gunpoint, meaning even if they put a gun to his head and they ask him who do you want to leave, he will pick those three people anytime, any day. So people's faces that was looking really, really downcast when Tasha was saved was mercy and elozonam and shay so guys watch out the game is on so remember as i said earlier there's gonna be a twist to the veto power game of chance 10 p.m today we are gonna be seeing what's gonna happen and guys question of a video who do you think who do you think is gonna win the veto power game of chance remember i said or ebuka said rather that whoever wins this veto power game of chance is going to be the ultimate veto power holder meaning that there is a 90 percent chance or 99 percent chance of that person winning this season's big brother niger show yes the only thing that will determine that that person does not win is the voting power of the viewing audience so guys this is a very very crazy one yes it is a very very crazy one so don't forget to tune into my channel first thing tomorrow morning because definitely I'm going to be giving you guys all the juicy details. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Don't forget, guys, don't forget to turn on post notifications because I'm definitely going to be feeding you guys with all of the juicy details. And what else? What else? What else? That's all for this particular episode of Frankly Speaking with Glory. Thank you guys so much for watching. And um, remember, there's no evictions this new week, there's no nominations, and there's no voting. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. Have an amazing Sunday night. Bye.